I'm really fucking happy right now. Like, you have no idea. I am so fucking psyched. There's finally, finally, a university arming their students to fight back in an active shooter situation. They are arming them. That's fucking fantastic. They're finally able to fucking fight back. Hey, hey what did they arm them with? Was it nine? With what? Did you just say hockey pucks? You're giving them hockey pucks. Oh. Guys. They're arming them with hockey pucks. You guys know, guess, uh, that's, um, hockey pucks. These are the people that want to create common sense gun laws. These guys. The same people who think hockey puck beats bullet. Like, are you, f fuck, you gotta be stupid. You gotta be really fucking stupid to think that. Now, alright, now let's do some simple math here, okay? Simple math. If these students, we're gonna go ahead and give them the benefit of the doubt. These students, and say that these students can throw a hockey puck at the same speed as the world record fastball okay that's 105.1 miles per hour now an AR-15 shoots at 3,000 feet per second the bullet travels out of that gun at 3,000 feet per second that's 2,045.445 miles per hour you understand that they could throw a hockey puck if they're as good as the guy who set the record for the world's fastest fucking fastball they can throw a hockey puck at 105.1 miles per hour and that bullet travels out of that gun at 2045.455 miles per hour you know what that means that means in the time it takes for that hockey puck to leave my hand and meet his forehead, he would be able to get off 19 bullets into my body. You understand what that means? It means I'm fucking dead. You know what happens when that hockey puck hits him? He's a little more pissed off. I mean, honestly, though, that's... They act like we don't have common sense. They have common sense with these gun laws. They have common sense. We don't. But apparently, we're fucking idiots. I mean, we're giving our fucking military guns. Those things are fucking expensive. When we could just give them hockey pucks and say, here, shit, whip these bitches at the enemy. Like, you gotta be fucking retarded. You gotta be completely retarded. But... Then again, these are the same guys that created gun-free zones. Now, let's look at some statistics for gun-free zones. See, 97.8% of active shooter situations happen in gun-free zones. I wonder why that is. I bet that's a fucking mystery. Maybe, just maybe, it has something to do with the fact that, uh... They know nobody there is armed to stop them. It means only 2.2% of active shooter situations happen outside of gun-free zones. Now, statistically, 15 to 17 people will die in the active shooter situations inside of gun-free zones. Guess how many people die in the other 2.2%? Two or three. Why? Because in the other 2.3%, there's a guy there, or a girl, who's armed and ready and blows that motherfucker away after he gets off two or three shots. Why? Because they're allowed to carry their guns there. 
common sense will tell you, if you make it illegal to have a gun there, the only people you're stopping are the people that care about the fucking law. Obviously, the guy whose goal for the day was to kill, you know, as many people as humanly possible, doesn't care about the fucking law. He doesn't. He's not going to walk in with a gun and say, I'm going to murder as many people as humanly possible. I, uh, oh, man, there's a sign. There, there's, a, there's a sign that says, I can't. Fuck. I mean, I'm a mass murdering asshole, but not listening to a sign, that would just make you a fucking monster. What kind of sick fucker? God damn. I can't believe that happens. Liberals, let's be honest here. You're killing people. And you're so convinced that you're right, you're trying to make it worse. It's pathetic. Let's get back to that hockey puck shit and how stupid that is. I'm going to be honest here. I am a gun-toting asshole. And I absolutely hate mass shooters. If your entire mission is to kill as many innocent people as humanly possible, you're a piece of shit. And honestly, because I'm a douchebag, even if it gets me killed, I would absolutely love the opportunity to shit with the hockey puck into one of these fuckers' faces before I unload a clip into them. But there's a better way to go about this than arming your students with hockey pucks. You guys ever hear that joke about the guy who brought a knife to a gunfight? Damn it, well for the guy with a knife. Well, at least he has the opportunity to cut a motherfucker. These kids have hockey pucks. So how about instead of arming them with hockey pucks, we make it legal for them to carry their guns there. And then offer free classes in gun safety. And actually teach these kids facts about guns. Because right now the only facts they know about guns, well, facts they know about guns, is the stupid ass lies that liberals put out there just to try and accomplish their agenda. We can actually help these kids. Or we can give them hockey pucks and just say, try to knock them out before he kills all your friends. And that's, that's so fucking stupid. It's so stupid. Your university, your entire job is to charge kids hundreds of thousands of dollars to teach them. And you're this stupid? Oh my god, our society is fucked. Alright, that's all for today. Have a good day. And if you believe in common sense gun laws, you're a fucking idiot. And I honestly hope I hurt your feelings. Fuck you and your gun free zones. Bye.